I'm Mike Mouse 74 and this is Optimus Prime. For the Transformers community, please subscribe to Mike Mouse 74. <laughs> Musketeers, my mouse 74 with a Transformers video review. From Hero Mashers, I bring to you Optimus Prime. Here at the top, it says mash up with Ultra Magnus. So on the back here, it's showing you a picture of Optimus Prime with his firing blaster. Here it says swappable gear, works with any mashup. Up here it says lend a bot a hand or a leg. Then it says mix parts from. There's a picture of Optimus Prime. You can use Megatron, which is this piece right here. You can use Autobot Drift, which is this piece right here. You can use um, Starscream, which is the leg right here. You can also use Bumblebee, which is the foot right there. So without further ado, enough about the package, let's get Hero Masters Optimus Prime out of here and see what he's all about. Okay, so here we have Optimus Prime all laid out and disassembled. You can put them back together and it's actually really simple to do. You can start with the feet first, grab the legs, and there's a peg hole just on the top of Optimus Prime's leg right there and you can plug this in just like that. You can do the same thing with the other leg, grab the leg. Again, there's a peg hole on the top. Plug this in here just like that. And now you have the legs done. With the upper torso of Optimus Prime, you can grab the legs and plug this in here just like that. Do the same thing with the other side. You can plug it in. There's a peg hole just on the top right in there. And take it and plug this in here. A little bit tricky to do, but it can be done just like that with these two little red pieces you can connect them on Optimus Prime's arm just like that do the same thing with the other side you can grab this little red bit and plug that in there just like that with these two fists you can plug it in on Optimus Prime right there do the same thing with the other side just plug it in there's a peg hole right there and just plug it in just like that. And finally, with the head of Optimus Prime, there is a peg hole just on the bottom right there. You can move this forward or back, doesn't matter which way you do it. Grab the head and plug that on just like that. Okay, so here we have Optimus Prime put back together, looking really cool in his G1 look. With these, uh, with these little weapons here, there's pegs on either side, one here and one right there. You can plug them on the side of, of Optimus Prime. There's two peg holes, one there and one right there on each side. You can take these little weapons and plug them on the side just like that. And you can do the same thing again with the other side. There's a peg right there and there's two peg holes on the side of Optimus Prime here. And right there, you can take the weapon and plug that on just like so. So as shown on the inside of the packaging, Optimus Prime does come with a few accessories. You can take the fist off of Optimus Prime like that, grab the Energon Axe and plug this in just like that. And for the other side, you need to take this whole entire section right off of Optimus Prime, it is a little bit tricky, just pull it off like that, and with the fusion can of um, Ultra Magnus, take the fist, plug it in, there's a peg hole right there, plug that in there like that, and there's a peg hole just right there, and just grab the fusion can in, and you can plug that in there just like so, and just kind of get them, get them all situated, make sure he stands up alright. Like that. He also comes with his firing blaster, which does shoot out. There's a button right there, and all you have to do is press the button, and it actually shoots out pretty good. And just take the missile, plug that back in here just like that. You can make Optimus Prime hold it. Just take the firing missile, plug that on there just like that. 
And he also comes with another weapon of some sort, of some kind of um, some kind of fusion cannon, I, I guess. There's a couple of peg holes, one there and one right there. You can plug it along along the arm of Optimus Prime like that, or you can take it and plug it alongside the forearm of Optimus Prime, something like that, and kind of, like I said, to kind of get him situated to make sure he doesn't uh, fall over. Okay, for the details of Optus Prime, he has blue detailings on both sides of his legs, some gray molded detailings in the thighs, some yellow detailings there, some white detailings in the midsection, some blue detailings for the window, a nice Autobot logo on the side of the arm, some white detailings on the side of the arm right there, a little bit of white detailings in the face, the eyes are blue detailings, and the head is a little bit of blue detailings. So let's take a closer look, and you guys can check it out. Here's a quick headshot. Now for a quick comparison with Hero Master's Optimus Prime. Here's his counterpart, G1 Optimus Prime. So thanks for watching guys, this is Mike Mouse Sunny 4 with my video review. You have just seen Transformers Hero Master's Optimus Prime. This is an absolute great set and a lot of fun. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, support the mouse, support your Transformers community, stay tuned for more reviews to come. I want to thank everybody for watching and as always guys, Take care, everyone.